Hey guys, today we are in Golf Max 7 with a MIP2 based infotainment system and I'm going to show you how to switch it between the left hand drive and right hand drive modes. So over here you can see that it's already set to right hand drive mode. Uh, you can see that the CarPlay interface buttons are on the right side where the driver would be. Also, if you press the menu button here on the climate control, you will see this picture with the steering wheel on the steering wheel on the right side. So with a simple coding, I have OBD11 over here, which is already connected to the car. We can uh, change this uh, to a proper setting for the left hand drive vehicle. So we are going to enter a list of modules over here, scroll all the way, almost all the way down to the module 5F, which is the multimedia uh, mine unit. And over here, after a few seconds, uh, we can go to long coding and we are going to switch to the bit and byte view over here in the upper right corner and we are looking for byte index number 19 where is it? over here byte 19 and bit number 1 should be off when it's off and when we slide to write this new value we can already see that the image on the screen over here changed we can disconnect the device and CarPlay needs to be reconnected. So right now we can still see the old interface layout. So we can disconnect the USB cable, connect it back. And after a few seconds, and maybe more like a 20 second uh, time of waiting, we will have uh, CarPlay back over here on the display with the controls on the driver's side so let's give it those few more seconds i'm uh, using a wired, wired to wireless carplay adapter so it needs some additional time to connect to the phone and if i just plug my phone with the usb cable it would be already on oh we can see that it's over here and right now those controls are on the left side on the driver's side okay so that's pretty much it Thank you for watching. In the description below this video, you'll find some more details about this coding procedure. And uh, that's it. Give me a thumbs up if you liked it and subscribe for future videos. See you soon.